Shelby Rogers, a winner today over Maria Sakari. She matches her career best effort into the third round here at Wimbledon. Now inside the top 40 in the live rankings, and we welcome in the American Shelby Rogers here on Tennis Channel. Shelby, great to see you. Great performance. How you doing? Hey, guys. This was the motivation to make it on so I can talk to you guys. How you doing? Yeah, thanks for having me. Um, <laughs> nice to be here. Uh, that's awesome. Uh, we love to be the motivation. Uh, what, what did you like most about your game out there today? I'm really happy that I was able to serve it out and finish today in one set because it was super weird being suspended last night with the darkness, trying to get some sleep with a half a match finish. Um, so it was really nice to just get in and get out today. Shelby, I just got a note from someone that says, Shelby Rogers, giant killer. Do you like that? Do you buy that? I like it for now, but the goal is to be the giant, right? <laughs> so one of these days, I'll, I'll be the favorite. Um, but for now, you know, I'm happy just to get any match wins on the grass. It's so nice to be back after a couple of years. And I feel like I'm still figuring out some things on this surface. But today, um, I thought I served really well and played really smart, which is important. Great win today over Sakari. We were surprised you'd never played her before in your next round. You play an opponent, Rabakana, who you just played a few weeks ago. What, what is the difference in that in terms of your preparation? Yeah, the, the variety of players out here is crazy. I mean, every match is so different. Uh, Maria, you know, has a bit more spin on her balls. Um, going into tomorrow, I'm going to see some big serves coming at me. So there's a lot of adjustments to make, I think. But for the most part, you just try to focus on what you can control and on your side of the court. And, you know, the court's the same size. You play the ball, but definitely a contrast in styles. And you did that so well today, Shelby. Uh, about a month ago, you wrote some thoughts on Twitter after a, a tough win in Strasbourg. I thought it really summed up the spirit of our sport well. What did you say? Yeah, I just basically, um, well, I'd finished a match with Christina McHale, who's one of my really good friends. And we, you know, went <laughs> the limit. We played over three hours, final set tiebreaker. And, you know, we both had match points. And I was just expressing how difficult it is to do this, to be on tour, to play this sport week in and week out with so much depth and so many great players out here in the bubbles. You know, we're trying to do our best out here. And I feel like we just are sometimes underappreciated and for someone I respect so much Christina McHale I always have um she's an incredible player and I really looked up to her you know when I first started playing on the tour and I just wanted people to realize like you know both players leave it all out on the court every single time and we're traveling to a different city every week and I don't know I just you know one of those moments things thoughts were coming over me and I wanted to just show my respect to all the players out here because, I mean, there are no easy matches. I don't care who you put anyone up against, anybody can win. Um, and I just, yeah, I wanted to show some respect for my my colleagues, if you will. <laughs> well, we, we certainly appreciate that. Uh, they were beautiful words and uh, a wonderful performance again today. Uh, whether you're the favorite or not, you're our favorite. So well done today into the third round. Congratulations and uh, join us again. If we continue to be the motivation, come on back. Would love to come back. Thank you, guys.